No, you're supposed to just slurp it in. Pills, woo! Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about Korean hangover drinks or Korean hangover gummies or jellies or sticks or I don't even know what these round ones are called. <laughs> So you come and visit Korea, you're all excited about the nightlife, everybody's having fun. You are going out to the convenience store to buy whatever kind of alcoholic drinks that you want. These two are my favorite. I love this one, Perpitonga and Tara. But if you're in Korea, why not try some soju? Cero soju is really, really nice. You're not only drinking every night or during the day, if you're like me and you'd like to do natsu, which is drinking during the day, not just at night. But let's say you want to have a couple of drinks, but you don't want to be affected the next day and you don't want to be hung over the next day. These are what you want to have in your pocket every time you go out and drink. So here in Korea, you can buy alcoholic beverages at convenience stores. You can buy them at any convenience store or supermarket or any kind of grocery store. They don't have liquor stores or designated stores that sell liquor and alcoholic beverages only. You can get them literally anywhere. You can even get them at e-mart. So for these over-the-counter anti-hangover drinks or gummies or pills, whatever you want to call them, they come in different flavors and different types. You have your liquid, you have your gummy, jelly, wobbly type, and you also have the pills. The ones that I don't have with me currently are the ones that are sold at pharmacies. If you go to a pharmacy and ask your pharmacist here in Korea for a sukchi heso umnyo, they give you a liquid type and a little tiny bottle where you can mix together and drink up. Or you can also ask them for the pills. Usually they are known to be consumed before you drink or the day after consuming any martinis, beers, drinks, and sojus. But it is suggested that you take one before you start drinking or in the middle of your meal or your drinking party, and then one the day after if you still feel really hungover. The most well-known and the most famous one is called Condition. These have been advertised by many celebrities and have become the most commonly known anti-hangover products. Nowadays, there are so many products that you really have to try them out in order to figure out which one works really well for you. Other than the over-the-counter products that are sold at convenience stores, there are ones that you can get at pharmacies, like I told you. So, how do they work? And are they categorized as medicine? Well, obviously, because they're sold at convenience stores, they're not categorized as medicine. They're just regular supplementary products, kind of like vitamins you can get over the counter. So how do they actually work? They're supposed to slow down the absorption of alcohol in your body and increase the speed of breaking down acetaldehyde. Did I pronounce that right, acetaldehyde? So basically, it's breaking things down faster than normal so that you get all of the alcohol out of your system fast. It's tricking your body to think that you're less sensitive to the amount of alcohol you have stuffed down your throat. There are also ones that trick your body to think you're really good at drinking, to trick your body to think that you're a heavy drinker. However, professionals say that people who turn beet red like me, because I turn beet red from head to toe when I drink, these people may not fully be able to enjoy the benefits of these products or drinks because they aren't able to process the ingredients as fast as others. If your body is not able to process alcohol and you just go beet red because your body just doesn't take alcohol, it's just not good at consuming alcohol, then your body might not be good at consuming these as well. Your body is just slower at processing things and digesting things than other people. Note that these products are supposed to help your hangover and the state of your body while drinking or consuming alcohol or the day after. They're not supposed to be like, why can't I snap? <laughs> They're not supposed to be like, bam. You're like totally awake, no hangover. No, they don't do that. They're supposed to help you recover faster than normal. I'm gonna open one of these to show you. 
So this is the condition stick, which has like this like gooey jelly, like flabby weird. So it has like this like jelly like stuff since, you know, you're supposed to just slurp it in, but this is what it looks like. This one smells like uh, apple. This one smells like apple. But, and then there are the ones that come in pills like these. They kind of look like those Chinese um, medicine pills. Woo! But those are the pills. And then obviously the drinks, you just gulp, 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 and you just drink it. I suggest taking one at a time. Be safe, everyone. Heavy drinking may lead to other diseases and health conditions and disorders. So if you're here visiting Korea, have fun. Don't go overboard, all right? I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Ooh, how am I supposed to? Maybe I should put these in like Ziploc bags or something. Yeah, then put them in the fridge. I wonder if there's like this many pills for a reason. Okay, I'm definitely putting into putting this one in the fridge so that I can have it tomorrow morning because I am planning on drinking tonight.